TikTok has been raiding the offices of U.S. tech giants on both sides of the Atlantic as it looks to significantly increase the size of its global workforce. Despite the threat of a U-ban from Secretary of State Mike Pompeo, TikTok announced this week that it plans to hire 10,000 people in the country over the next three years. Its largest U offices are in Mountain View and New York. The Chinese-owned video sharing app, which already employs 1,400 people in the U.S., has hired dozens of staff from Google and Facebook including several high-profile executives. TikTok and Facebook declined to comment. Google did not immediately respond to CNBC's request for comment. Worldwide, TikTok employs 172 ex-Googlers and 165 ex-Facebookers, according to analysis on LinkedIn. Breaking out the U numbers, TikTok employs 79 people who used to work at Google and 79 who used to work at Facebook. Some of them left Google and Facebook years ago but many of them have recently quit the Silicon Valley firms to join TikTok, which has become wildly popular in the last year. Notable hires include Blake Chandley, who was Facebook's vice president of global partnerships until recently. He left in January 2020 after more than 12 years at the company to become TikTok's VP of Global Business Solutions, based out of New York. There's also Chen Linli who left Facebook last year after nine years at the company and now works as TikTok's director of partnerships in Mountain View. Prior to Facebook she worked at Google. TikTok is also hiring recruiting professionals from U-Tech giants to help it expand in the country. Kim Louie, was a recruiting manager at Facebook up until March. She is now TikTok's head of talent acquisitions, based out of New York. Louie was a technical sourcer at Google before she joined Facebook. Meanwhile, Raymond Chen left his technical recruiter role at Google's New York office last month to join TikTok's talent acquisition team and hunt out security talent. It's a similar story over in Europe, where Facebook lost another veteran to TikTok recently. Trevor Johnson, who spent over 11 years at Facebook before becoming Instagram's director of market operations in EMEA, joined TikTok as head of marketing and global business solutions in Europe this year. Theo Bertram, a Google veteran who was senior manager of public policy in Europe left in December 2019 to join TikTok, where he is now director of government relations and public policy for Europe. David Hochter, who worked in Facebook's global accounts team in London, joined TikTok in April last year to work on building the company's partnerships with brands. None of the new TikTok hires immediately responded to CNBC's request for comment. Timothy Armu, chief executive of Fanbytes, a company that helps brands advertise through social video, told CNBC that people at Google and Facebook have the playbook for building a large advertising business.